there's a bit of a congratulatory mood in the room at the White House where the president and some of his top advisors are meeting with GOP leaders and they're talking about what was said in the speech last night, the priorities, the to-do list that the president set for Congress and also about the process that is going to be getting underway. Take a quick listen to the president's remarks. Thank you very much. We're just here to start the process. Uh, it begins as of now, and we think we're going to have tremendous success. And thank you very much. Thank Appreciate you. Very much. Thank you very much. Thank thank you. Very much. That process, of course, will be. That process, of course, will be a very involved one because of the very long agenda that the president has set for Congress. Health care reform, though, being the very first thing that they will be focused on. I'm told by an aide that the topic of the weekly Republican conference meeting that happens tomorrow morning will be on health care reform and how to put some of the nuts and bolts that the president acknowledged last night, like tax credits for Americans to buy their insurance, potential access for those with pre-existing conditions, and also the ability of insurance companies and consumers to buy and sell this insurance across state lines. So there's a lot of meat to put on the bones here where policy is concerned. I also want to tell you what Sean, Sean Spicer, the press secretary, told our colleague Eamon Javers a little while ago. He was asked by Eamon exactly what Dow 20,000 means, what it means for the optimism in the economy. And Secretary Spicer said that he didn't want to tie it directly to the president. He didn't want to tie a direct link, unlike what the president and Treasury Secretary Mnuchin had said uh, in the last week. But he said that it does give the sense or reflect the renewed optimism by business, by economists, and by just people on the ground, confidence in the country and the agenda and the propensity to hire. Guys? Yeah, I wonder if Spice will heal back from the president on that one. <laughs> more definitive, Kayla. Hey there, thanks for checking out CNBC on YouTube. Be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on all of the day's biggest stories. You can also click on any of the videos around me to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.